Developing right now, we are learning about the hard landing at New York's LaGuardia Airport last night. The landing gear of a jet collapsed just after touching down on the runway. You're looking now at some surveillance video of the moment of impact. ABC's Lisa Stark has the latest now on this investigation. It began as a routine landing filmed at a passenger's window when suddenly the plane makes a violent hard impact. The front of the jet slamming into the ground. This morning, two views of the frightening landing from inside, confusion and fear. And from the outside, you can see the sparks flying, flames shooting out as the nose of the Boeing 737 scrapes along the runway. Authorities say as the jet landed, the nose gear collapsed, sending the plane skidding at least 2,000 feet down the asphalt. The aircraft skidded down the runway on its nose and then veered off and came to rest about halfway down the runway. In the tower, controllers scrambled to roll emergency equipment and stop other flights. On board, passengers say they felt two hard thuds. White smoke filled the air. The whole plane just went down very quickly, and um, that's when the door blew in. They hit the ground pretty hard and slid, and there was a lot of smoke filling the plane. Everyone got out on the emergency slides. No one seriously injured, but six passengers and four crews sent to local hospitals for evaluation. All you want to do is get on the ground and, and uh, kiss the earth. Landing gear problems do happen, but there's usually a warning light in the cockpit. Apparently not this time, catching everyone by surprise. And we have learned that all the runways at LaGuardia Airport are back open now, but some delays and cancellations following that accident are certainly slowing air travel now around the nation.